It can't be. What is it? It can't be. What did you do, Ray? Oh, shut Tell me! Mamma mia! Mamma mia! Are you kidding me? That just happened. Wow. Wow! Well, there's something you don't see every day. Space is the place! Oh, my God! The Defiant has landed, and I can't think of anything more defiant than doing a short video on the Defiant. I just wanted to show this thing off in a quick video. Down the road, I'll definitely be showing it off more, maybe doing some restorations. But for now, I just wanted to sit there and be defiant. I had been looking for one a couple of months back, and I quickly realized that it was definitely out of my price range. I picked up most of my vintage toys about a decade ago when everything was either half or a third or a quarter of the price it goes for today. And the G.I. Joe Defiant Space Shuttle Complex has definitely at least doubled, if not tripled or quadrupled, in the decades since I had been hunting down most of my vintage G.I. Joe vehicles. There were some being sold locally, but they were just way out of my price range. I always say bills come first. And I had given up the hunt. I mean, I've got plenty of stuff to enjoy. Just when I thought I was out, they pulled me back in. But one showed up locally, and it was the right one for me. It's got a few cracks, a few breaks, a few missing pieces, a little bit of discoloration. So this might just be my biggest example to show you. Buy and complete. Missing pieces. Discoloration. Broken parts. Don't get too hung up on the little things, because when you take a step back, it can still blow your mind. And you would think that was the highlight of my day, bringing this thing home. But it was actually meeting the previous owner and his son, who are both fans of the channel. It was really awesome chatting with you, Aaron, as well as with Andrew. I'm so happy to hear that Andrew's a Brave Star fan. He can definitely look forward to seeing more of the good Marshall on this channel in the future, as well as the Defiant. But for now, I'm just going to enjoy the playware. I like the fact that it was used for its intended purpose. It was a toy meant for fun to bring friends together as well as a place for Joes to show camaraderie, and, for one particular Joe, a cozy place to take a nap. In the immortal words of Randy Savage, space is the place, and the sky's the limit. Till next time, stay defiant. Nerdmas Day. Two, one, we have liftoff! Yo, Joe! T.I. Real American Hero!